Hey everyone, it's me. <laughs> We're back to Idle Heroes and um, I want to apologize for my inactivity. Last week was super duper busy and then as you can hear, I got really sick so my voice is totally shot. Um, yeah, it's really hurting and it's really killing me. But I gotta try and get this video done. Um, so last week we had the shop event. I finished with about 2,500 things and I'm just, I'm gonna go all in on orbs, try and prep my orbs for the Black Friday event and things like that. Um, plus orb pulls are usually a lot luckier for me than scrolls. Um, <clears throat> have to excuse me if I die coughing at some point during this video. It's a, it's a good possibility. Um, so we have some value packages where you can pick up a Garuda and they have this new Sword of Storm skin for Zia, which looks really awesome. I think it looks really cool. Damage reduced block and holy damage, so pretty neat. Um, so we have Wishing Fountain, chance to get some more orbs. Always complete Wishing Fountain event is good and they've even thrown in the Lucky Wishing Fountain for us uh, where if you spend you know a certain amount of uh, draws on the Wishing Fountain and then the Super Wishing Fountain and you can reset it and get... <coughs> <coughs> mm, excuse me. Get more stuff. So we also have the Shelter Mission which they have some pretty great heroes in here. They've got Ormus. For Fortress, so he's a really good heal heal healer now. Uh, the only one in here that it's kind of like meh is Corpse Demon. Uh, Heart Watcher, she's great for PvE, really fantastic for that. And then Scary, he's really great for PvE too. Um, yeah, especially if you get multiples of him, he's just beastly. So, And then of course, just pretty much ignore the light and darks. Uh, and particularly those, those are not particularly good light and dark heroes um, and then chance for armor so I tried refreshing my wheels several times and I just couldn't get anything good on my super fountain I was hoping to so I could do pulls on it but maybe I'll do that in another video but we're gonna go ahead and go until we get the four star on this one so four star four star um, other new things, I believe, I believe they just reworked Aspen a little bit, or I guess I should say adjusted Aspen skills. Um, I kind of glanced at it and it looks like uh, they changed it maybe just a little bit, but not really a lot. Uh, so yeah, not really sure. Well, we'll look at it. We'll look at that next. Come on, four star, where are you at? Mm -hmm. There it is. Okay. Sorry, I'm trying to save my voice as much as possible. Just it, it really hurts bad. Okay, so orbs and lucky fountain. Oh, wow, so it gives you multiple uh, goes on it. That's really cool. <coughs> so, oh yeah, okay, there's 10 rounds on it. That's neat. Good, good chance to get some more dust and whatnot. So let's go ahead and take a look at Aspen here. So, I was like, the thing I noticed, uh, I don't remember if this one said on basic attack also, I, I can't remember, but this one, it says now that he's going to target enemy with the lowest HP. Um, yeah. So that's new. Uh, that all looks pretty much the same. Yeah, I don't. I'm not really sure. I haven't really 
had a chance to read up on the other stuff. Um, so I don't know how different it's really going to make him, but having him target the enemy with the lowest HP will actually be really good for Aspen, because that's when he gets the heals and whatnot. So that's good news for Aspen. Um, but yeah, I'm going to keep this video really short just for the sake of my throat. Um, if I still need copies of Heart Watcher, I might pick up the Heart Watcher and then I may pick up the scary. I'm not sure. I might. Just to have it. Um, yeah, those are some good heroes. So you guys should definitely get that. And keep, keep, keep saving. We're coming up really soon to the big Black Friday event. And then we're going to be at the end of the year with the Christmas and New Year's event. So save, save, save. Get ready. It's coming. <laughs> Hopefully my voice will be better by then. <coughs> Oh my gosh, I'm dying. <laughs> uh, but I think that's it for this episode. Like I said, I'm just going to keep it short and sweet. So thanks so much, guys, for your patience and for watching. And if you enjoyed, make sure you like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you next time. See ya.